Hey Jonesy Babes and Anonymous Jonesy Babes. Welcome back to my channel. So I just want to come in and talk about Wade Wilson for a second. Basically the social media accounts that are in his name. So on Instagram, there's a Wade Stephen Wilson official account. And it gives you updates about Wade and stuff like that. They even had a countdown, I guess, to his next court date to see if he's going to get the death, death penalty or just life in prison. And... They had posted something about Wade's communication was restricted. And you're going to see it here as I'm doing my commentary. Right? So I went ahead and screenshot it because I'm like, okay, this, this is interesting. And it wasn't, I think it was posted not too long ago. I think it was posted not too long ago. And then seven days ago, seven days ago, they posted his contact was partially restored, okay? And then 20 hours ago, wear blue for Wade. What? These people are insane. They do know he was found guilty for murder, right? So, I don't understand what's going on in these people's mind. The baby, the delusion is insane. And then, you know, I always look through the comment section and see what people are saying. And a lot of those comments are in Spanish, but you can click to translate, you know, translate what it's saying. And I'm surprised that there's a lot of Spanish women supporting him. But you know what? Any, anything is possible these days. So I shouldn't be surprised, right? But... This comment, somebody wrote, I love you, my king. What in the world? I love you, my king? Wow, that's crazy. That's crazy. I, I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with these people. So they they have something weird where you could wear blue for weight. You know, that was posted 20 hours ago. Seven days ago, his contact was partially restored. It's it's just insane to me that these people are, are going through all of this to support him. I wonder how would they feel if he did this to one of their family members. Would they still be saying support Wade? Wear blue for Wade? Would they still be saying that? I don't think so. But it to me, it's just sick. Anybody that supports serial killers or any killer is disgusting. It's horrible. It's horrible. And I just don't understand it. I really don't. I don't understand it. Now, last night I was, you know, just surfing on the internet and I came across an article that had, you know, um, it was talking about Wade's trial. It, it was in trial, right? And yet it said something about, I'm trying to remember what it said. But I did read that when the police um, finally got to Wade, you know, he, he had teeth missing. Now, I know that he got beat up in jail and his mouth got messed up. But they said that his teeth were missing. So I was like, wow. I didn't write anything down because I was just reading the article, you know, just to see what was out there and everything. And I was just I just thought that was interesting. I was like, hmm. So maybe, you know, when he was fighting with Christine, she bopped him in the mouth, you know? Ugh. I just, I just, it's just, it's just sad that this dude murdered two women, right? He murdered two women and people out here are supporting him. That's the, that's the kicking. That's the kicker right there. That's the kicker. You're supporting this man and he murdered two women. Two women that we know of, okay? That we know of. Hmm. Mm -mm. This is insane. But yeah, I just want to share that with you guys. Um, because I thought it was interesting. And on TikTok, oh my god. 
Oh my God, it's so many women over there on TikTok that supports him. It's just insane. I'm like, wow. It's crazy. It's crazy. But anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section. How do you feel about, you know, people saying wear blue for Wade? And, you know, how do you feel about his contact being restricted, but now it's partially restored? And why do you think they restricted his his communication in the first place. Okay. All right, you guys. I'll talk to you later.